Thank you, Representative, Representative Laviel. Thank you very much, Mr. Chairman. Uh, I am I'm very sympathetic to our colleagues in southeastern Connecticut who have uh, have a need for road construction, and I'm from a part of the state myself in southwestern Connecticut, where in many cases we've waited for a very long time for infrastructure improvements, and there are many that we don't have still. Um, I, I nevertheless uh, join my colleagues who spoke before uh, in opposition to tolls uh, for a number of reasons and, and in the, also in the hope to find a, another way of uh, finding the funds to provide this infrastructure. I have a few concerns. Uh, and one of them is, is the language in this particular bill, which uh, refers to maintenance and repair. Uh, there is a, there's some language here that indicates that the tolls would be discontinued when the need for maintenance has been satisfied. I don't know that maintenance is ever fully funded. It should be permanent and, and go on as long as the road exists. So that, that makes me very uncomfortable. Uh, the second thing in here is is about extensions, which uh, that to me would apply to extensions of roads that already exist on which people are unaccustomed to paying tolls. And uh, I, can, I can see that being extended to um, roads, certainly in other parts of the state, which uh, uh, where, where people are not in favor of, of this measure. Um, there is some, I have the same uncertainty about the process. Uh, federally, would we be insured of the funds that we currently receive and what would the approval be? And, and as well, does this open the door to other kinds of tolling and uh, decisions to extend um, the mechanism of tolls to other parts of the state and in other ways and to other types of roads, perhaps those that already exist. Uh, finally, my final remark uh, is that again, this is a this is a proposal to uh, raise whatever you'd like to call it revenue taxes fees uh, on our people who are driving to work every day, who are driving for other reasons, who are driving to school, whatever, in the context of many, many, many other tax proposals that have been made uh, in the budget that we're reviewing now. And uh, that troubles me greatly since we should also be looking at some other solutions. So thank you very much, Mr. Chairman. I, I will not be voting for this bill. Thank you, Representative Leviel.